bright lights. Right, today is my getting it all done, getting the garden done day. Last night, I was so raring to go, and this morning, I, I just can't be bothered now. I hate it when that happens, when you sleep through your enthusiasm for a job. Right, let's have a little walk around and I'll show you what I'm going to do. I'm going to move these pots back to where they belong or find a new home. I need to cut off this rose, it's died. I'm gonna cut him off there because these are all self-seeded. This was a plant from my friend Julie about five years ago, a bit of nigella. Um, I'm going to sweep along here and put these zinc pots back there and um, scrub the zinc pots because you know, they're just dirty. Um, going to deal with that. I'm going to put some compost in here and sow some more of these little um, pansy viola things, although I think they're being eaten by ants or by wood lice. This all needs sweeping up. That's looking good. That needs a scrub. This all needs sweeping up. That, I need to decide what to do with that. I mean, it's broken, but I could probably, I don't know, utilise it till it's completely pantsed. Pantsed? I'm showing you all the bad bits of the garden now. I'm showing you all the bad bits of the garden now. Um, this area all needs sorting. The hot bin is listing, so I need to empty it, find a new home for it. This is wood that's just been piled here for ages as a bit of an insect haven, but it needs moving. These need to come down. That all needs dealing with. Um, I'm not actually going to do anything with any of this lot today. It can just carry on growing. I'm going to sow some <clears throat> carrots in here. Oh look, I've got a little nasturtium coming up there. I don't know what these are. I suspect they're weeds. But what weeds? They do look like broccoli. So I don't know what to do about them. I need to dismantle this. This is my sort of nursery bed. Something's chomping on this hydrangea. I need to dig out these, pop them up. Just deal with everything. And then flatten this. I've got far too much to do already in one day. I haven't even made it round there yet. This needs chopping up for the compost. The fence needs repainting, but that's not a job for this year. I'm not doing that this year. I want to chop all these euphorbia heads off because they're going quite brown. And that one there, which self-seeded, needs to come out. I need to deal with this wood that was a trellis that broke and decide whether that trellis is coming down or whether I'm going to use it. A job for another day is all this needs strimming so that I can get to my compost bins. It's gone crazy. Also need to cut the tops of those willows off and poke them in the ground over here. Chicken coop over there, need to sort that out. Let's just pause for a moment to marvel over this. Can't see if it's focused or not. The smell is heavenly. It's just so beautiful. What a beautiful plant. And it's still not completely in full bloom. Need to prune the olive trees, refill the pots a bit. This one's started to list. I do not recommend these zinc things from Sarah Raven. 
they just don't last. They look nice, but then they go rusty. Move these pots and empty them. Clean the glass on this um, table. Move those two pots. Move those two pots. Move this pot. Everything needs a feed. Look, this Escalonia is going. I think it's an Escalonia. It's... Needs a feed. That clematis needs potting up. Empty those pots ready for planting up. Take those foxgloves out of there and plant them elsewhere. Empty that. Uh, I need to deal with this area. What is all of this? I don't know. Something to do with the hot tub, I think. This church bench was getting thrown out by my friend and I couldn't bear it, so I rescued it. But it doesn't look right here. I suppose the chair is the more sort of companion. What's it is? Anyway, it doesn't look right. It needs a sort out. Scooters, skateboard, a recycling bin with uh, kindling in it, I think. Yeah, I mean, that's just ugly. This all needs sweeping. That needs emptying. That needs potting up. That needs potting up. Those two need planting in the ground. They need relocating. I've treated it. Now listen to that, Margot. I've treated my box for box caterpillar, sprayed it with nematodes. That rose needs tying into the new wires on the walls. Those weeds need boiling water putting on them. This rose needs, needs some sort of support up there and tying in. This needs dealing with. There's the swing ball there, but most of this is just sort of builder's crap. <clears throat> this is builder's crap. This is where the chair went manky through the winter. That is where the dog jumped on the furniture after she tried to eat the hedgehog. More builder's crap. More building crap. What's going on here? Looks like... Just need to clean things up. Everything's just horrid. Drain pipe, nail gun stuff. I need to prune these olive trees. There we go. There are the jobs, let's get started. I probably won't be back much until I show you the finished results. And I cannot wait to be in here with a glass of fizz and the fire on at around eight o'clock this evening. Got in my sandal. Bloody hell. Toby's busy mowing the lawn there, look. Sauntering along with a wheelbarrow. Hello. Oh. Oh, Shut foot in the way. He's shut. That's right, yeah. Right, Baba. Right, let's, Baba. Let's get this paddock topped. Oh, wow. Don't run into my new chicken coop bits. Uh, I can't 
can't get to my compost. No. No. Oh, I can't wait to get my chickens. Yeah. First of June, they're coming. Look, he's a little monkey. Yeah. Dad. Yeah. He's just sort of got my hat on. Thinks, he, it. thinks he's fancy. Yeah, I stole it off him though. Look at that flower bed. Oh, this rose is going to be nice when it comes out. All right. Got some nice big gaps I can fill with stuff. Put some stuff in there. Oh, look, they're um, snowdrops. They need covering. <laughs> I've been on it all morning, five hours I've been going for and I've done loads but feel like nothing's had that wow moment, you know, that kind of step back and go, good job. Pfft, never mind, let's just keep going. I was hoping to have this video where it was like, here's the before and here's the after. That's not going to happen. I've also had a mini bonfire and now there's ash all in the house. Silly me. I'm going to have something to eat in a minute. And also, I almost forgot about my sourdough. I, these days, use Elaine Food Bods method for sourdough. I, use, I, I follow it faithfully so if you want to know how I do it she's on YouTube and she has a blog or a website Elaine food bod master recipe that's what you want I do the cold start method Set the timer for very nice. Hot, hot, hot. Look at that. I'm ever so pleased with that. Lovely. Absolutely. Oh, bird nearly went on my little bird feeder. Absolutely chuffed. I don't think I've made a good one like this in ages. Okay, I mean business. Not really looking forward to doing this. Lickety up. It's not really ready to be emptied. I just need to empty it so I can move it. I need a fork. Ah, don't you wish you were me? Oh, oh my goodness. I hate gardening. I hate it a lot. This is pants. I don't like it. Pants and bum and pants. Oh. Oh. What's that doing in there? 
aren't they, boy? Don't even know where I'm gonna put this compost bin. a wheelbarrow and then back into the compost bin. Look at all these worms. Come on, you need to go in there. Come on. everybody my fitness is up to date. Don't tread on them, there's nails sticking up. I am hot and sweaty. It's gonna look so different without this bit of structure. Ooh, I'll break all that up and it can go on the fire pit. Is this asking for trouble? Yes, it is. Asking for trouble, that is. of little boys everywhere. A shed and then I'll probably take and take a Google pick. So that job took 11 minutes as well. Nobody uses the trampoline anymore so I'm gonna get rid of it. It's about nine years old um, and then part of it is from lockdown, I had to get a noose around during lockdown because we had a storm and it broke. Um, so, yeah, the boys have outgrown it. It's it's not good enough to sell. It's not really good enough to pass on. So I'm going to dismantle it and take it to the tip. Can you hear Margot? She's squeaking at me. Take it to the tip, and then I'll take a photograph, a screenshot of from Google Earth of this plot of land here and then I'll put it on my iPad and with my pencil thing I'll sketch out a new plan for this area. I'd like a shed, a garden shed because at the moment I've got all my tools and things in the greenhouse which is not ideal. Tools fall over and smash window panes so that's not ideal. So it'd be good to get a garden shed and um, to that pitiful dog and just change the layout a bit 
of the veg beds. I'm not a massive fan of raised beds because they shelter slugs and snails. And what you gain from a raised bed, you can replicate really with some fleece in the earlier months to protect your crops. So I think I might try that. I can always put raised beds in again. These ones are older than Wilf, about 14, 15 years old, and they're just beginning to rot into bits. I can't really show you. I'm fed up now. I, I feel like I want to have a shower, pick my spot, <laughs> put some makeup on, you know, refresh, and um, sit in the hangout. Right. Oh, poor old dog. Anyone would think she was being mistreated. Can you hear him? Oh, Toby's taking him out to the field. Oh, it's making a fizzing noise. Poor little thing. I'm getting in the shower. I'm absolutely dig it. I'm filthy. I'm sweaty. I've got mud on me. I haven't done half the jobs on my list, but I've made a good a good dent in them. <sighs> that feels better. I've had a shower. I've put on some fresh makeup and I'm gonna go down and pour myself a glass of fizz. Yes, sir. Oh, hanging up a towel with one hand. <laughs> it's not really easy. I'm gonna come back and blow dry my hair later. Got a top on from Vinted and my new skirt. Gotta get the washing in in a minute, but I'm gonna drink my Prosecco and edit yesterday's vlog. This looks so much better. Need to wash these footrests, but I don't think I'll get the cushions back in the cover. So I think I might have to scrub it by hand. I brought some house plants out. They look jolly, don't they? I need to put stuff in there. Fanny it and fluff it up a bit. Oh, look, it's a teddy and a doggy. Ah. You know, I said I was going to get the professional in. Here he is, wearing <laughs> a pair of what are they called those shoes. Sandals. No, they've got a name, haven't they? Like Heimlich's. Heimlich's. Yeah, what are they called? <laughs> yeah, they're Heimlich manoeuvres. What are they called? Hermans or something? What if are they you called? Get it... Have a stocks. Birkenstocks. Birkenstocks. If you choke. Yeah. If I choke. I shall rock up with my home legs. <laughs> <laughs> I did save Wilfred's life once when he was choking. And you didn't even have some home legs on your feet? No, I didn't. I just knew what to do. <laughs> so Toby's going to. He's doing this with a glass of Prosecco. <laughs> it's not Prosecco, my dear. What is it? Cremon Le Rosier. Le Rosier? I don't know. <laughs> or Coin de Loire, maybe? No, I don't know. Yeah. Right. Now get the get get it out. 
put that there. Now I've, now I've even, um, no, I reckon you can loosen it you off. You can pull that up now. Right, there you go, Maggie. <gasps> Look at that. Get the professionals in. Mm. Two more to go. Oh, he's actually doing it. Lovely chocolate. Got a taste for it now, haven't you, darling? Really good loaf. Possibly one of my best. I thought I'd messed it up. I thought it had overproved, but it's lovely. I've just tasted a bit. It's lovely. 